channel on this lovely sunny uh, day. Um, I'm recording it on Friday morning, so uh, I'm not sure when it'll be going up yet. I just thought I'd show you my July empties. I've done really well, ladies. So uh, my stock box is getting down some, so I I'm quite chuffed. So I thought I'd share with you what I've uh, been using. First up is this um, all clean um, balm. It's supposed to smell of um, mandarin. I got this off just my look, but Amazon sell it as well. It's one of the Korean skin cares. Um, it was a balm and it came with like the little spoon to get it out. It was nice, um, but I, the Pampered Wolf recommended that and I would buy it again but I don't know about you but I'm never wowed by any skincare as such I'm, I'm, I always say I'm a brand tart but um, I haven't found anything that I really like that I would keep going back to I always like like a cleanse and polish or a balm anything I use with a cloth um, I don't like to just wash my face with something and swill it off one because I get too wet but I, I like a cloth because I feel as though it's exfoliating at the same time. So I would buy that again. Um, yeah, it was all right. Um, so I bought that separate. This, I, I cut the tube in half. This was out the M&S um, beauty bag that they did uh, a couple of months ago. It's called Perfect Legs Body Butter. Sounds a bit strange. I couldn't decide at first whether it was for my legs or my body, but it was for your body as well. But I found it a bit thick um, to put on. Um, I like something with a, um, a finer texture, really, um, a thinner texture. So I wouldn't go for that one again. My trusty steward deodorant. I know aerosols um, get a bad review, but um there was there's a company you might have seen if you're on instagram um called up circle is it up circle i think so and they bought a deodorant out um and it's on subscription i've tried cream deodorants before and I, they just leave me feeling sticky i tried the wild i wasn't keen at that what didn't suit me but this up circle one um you get the refills then in your subscription uh, I really like that. I stayed dry all day um, and there was no stickiness, there's no nasties in it. Um, it's even got no chalk. didn't know there was chalk in deodorant. I suppose that's why my windowsills are always dusty. <laughs> so, uh, yeah, shan't buy that again. Bold Natural Soap, that's my last bar that's in the shower now. I love Bold Natural Soap, but the thing that puts me off is the, pa the postage. Um, it's £4.50 um, or free if you spend over £50 and £50 is a lot to spend all in one go. So I have ordered a, a natural soap from Boots um, to see what that's like. If not, uh, if it's now good and it doesn't last like the um, bold natural soap, I will have to bite the bullet and just pay the postage. Sometimes I, I, I tend to think, well, if it's like a high street shop and you've got to pay postage, I think, well, it saves me going and it's saving me um, petrol and it's stopping me buying other things while I'm there. So sometimes I look at that, but that's just a one off. So I can't think like that. So I'll see how I get on. I've actually been using makeup products up. That was a Bobbi Brown lipstick. I used that up. Um, an Ariane Pool. Um, what does she class it? Mineral Illumination Pen. I used that up. Uh, now I've bought some mascara. Uh, oh, and I used a, an eyebrow pencil up. That was a Clinique. Used that up. And um, a Clinique, like, that's like one of those free mascaras. I used that up. That was really nice, but it had got it smudged on me. Um, as I've said before, I do smudge a lot. And that was the top shield, the Ariane Pool. That's all used up, it's dry. Because it, like before I had to use a primer and the um, top shield with my mascara. So I was like too 
the, so it'd be a coat of the primer, then two coats of mascara, and then a coat of my top shield. So I'd need to get ready about an hour before to put all my coats on. <laughs> but I have um, bought this Prime Lash um, Mascara. It's the Over 50 um, company um, that does it. It's Prime Prometics. Uh, I have got a discount code um, because I've um, recently asked me to join their affiliate programme. But I would buy that anyway and I paid for that with my own money. Um, I even bought the blush and the eyeshadow, uh, one of the eyeshadow sticks long lasting, which is what I've got on. And my eyelashes are really long and that doesn't smudge and it just needs the mascara and nothing else. So I'm loving that and that is something I will keep buying. Um, yes, yeah, so Nivea um, eye makeup remover, that's something I constantly buy as well. Vaseline um, Aloe Soothe 48 Light Moisturise, like that, I really like the smell, um, it smells really fresh so definitely buy that again. My Purple Shampoo, Purple Rain, it's by the Naughty uh, Company, 97% natural, tone correcting shampoo for blonde, silver and grey hair with blueberry and black currant, love that always buy that i'll get that from just my look and um i think my last lot was five pounds something and it's um it lasts 12 months and i what so that's a 250 ml tube not keen on the conditioner but i love the shampoo normally when i use that i will use an intensive conditioner as well so um i just use the two together um i had this in um pro probably a gift set um so that's the beauty pro retinol under eye patch nothing to say <laughs> had this discipline shadow work face serum can't say there was any difference three in one um hand cream anti-age see i cut this uh, thing out that's an Evia like that Q10 to get every last bit out. I had this in a beauty box, I think, or an advent calendar ultra repair cream, safe for sensitive skin. I w I'm not sure whether it was for your face or your body. What is it? Directions apply from head to toe once or twice daily as needed. I used that as a body lotion because that would have been too rich for my face nothing to say about that i had this i think in a beauty calendar and it was a revolution power fix mist uh like that possibly buy that again but uh wouldn't go mad it, it was okay i like the spray mist to just refresh you as well that was a scent i've obviously had this in a beauty box or advent calendar Santropay self tan purity. Don't know. <laughs> As I say, I'm never wowed by skincare. To be fair, um, makeup I am, and body uh, lotion and thing and shampoo, but skincare I've never used anything that I could say it's my go-to. So, and that was um, I've had this for absolutely ages. Um, Highborn London and it was a lip balm and it was in a orange sense. It was okay but I, I prefer something out of a tube I am using at the moment and I will buy this again to be fair. The Burt's Bees Watermelon. Love that. Love the fragrance of that. So I will stick to Burt's Bees in future because I just find it easy to put on because it's like a, a bullet isn't it as i say so that's my empties for july ladies um i love having a look at them at the end of the month and seeing how uh, many i've got um my daughter and my daughter-in-law we're on a, a group message and we all show our empties at the end of the month so uh for me i was dead chuffed i'd use makeup up that was my one thing so um yeah dead chuffed 
right i'm gonna love you and leave you and, uh, leave you to get on with whatever and i will see you on the next video thank you bye